Hi, I'm Mark, and I collect things. Sometimes I even play things, and today we're opening a Topps Chrome Star Wars Super Box. I thought I was finished ripping Topps Chrome product, but Costco is selling these Super Boxes, and there are cards that are exclusive to these boxes from Costco. Each Super Box has 10 five card packs, three exclusive four card silver packs here on the right. These are exclusive to Costco, and one exclusive oversized card. I ordered mine from the Costco website. They've been going in and out of stock. The retail price is $40, and then there's an additional 5% surcharge if you're not a Costco member. Here on the back, they do show the design of the Costco cards. This is a Mandalorian Super Fractor. All right, the first thing I want to check out is this oversized card. Looks like there are 10 different die cut cards. I'm not sure if there are any parallels or not. There is some cardboard reinforcement, which is great. We got Han Solo. This is kind of a silly looking card. Looks more like an ornament than a card. We'll take a look at the back of it. Number three of ten. Die cut exclusive. It looks like there's a hole you can punch out there at the top if you want to hang it up. We'll get Han over here in the corner to watch the break. All right, next we go straight for these silver packs, which are exclusive to Costco. There's a little bit of glue on them holding them in the package in between the packs. All right, pack one out of three of these Costco exclusive silver packs. You can see the card design is different than the regular base cards. Phoenix Shand, Saw Guerrero Refractor, Supreme Leader Snoke, and Uncle Owen. All right, we'll get into pack number two. Ray base card. Another refractor of Grand Admiral Thrawn. Pretty cool. Obi-Wan Kenobi base card. And a Princess Leia base. Our right, last of the exclusive silver packs. Grief Karga base card. Kira base. The Mandalorian base card. And Cassian Andor. There are numbered parallels of these, but we didn't find any in this super box. All right, these regular packs are also glued together, so I'm gonna get these all apart before I open them. All right, pack number one out of 10 of these regular packs. Lola base card, Pit Droid base card, Sacy 10, Captain Rex, and then an insert of Director Orson Krennic, Galactic Empire from the Galactic Civil War insert set. Pack number two. Steel Pecker, base card. Jason Sindola, base card. Wicket, base card. Ray, base card. And a Grand Admiral Thrawn Refractor. Go right along with the Costco exclusive refractor I just got. Here's a quick comparison of the two, the regular refractor on the left and the Costco exclusive refractor here on the right. Same image, just a different card design. Here's a quick look at the back of the cards. They're pretty much the same, but the text font and spacing is a little bit different. And I think the codes here on the bottom are also different. The Costco card is here on top. Here's pack number three. Gian base card, Riva base card, Dexter Jetster, Dryden Voss, and a refractor of Padme Amidala. Here's pack number four, and it looks like there's no red ray waves in these. Just the refractors. Maybe some inserts. Haja Estri base card, R5, D4, Finn, Han Solo, and a refractor of Luke Skywalker. Here's pack number five. 
Aunt Beru base card, Director Krennic base, Emperor Palpatine. There's a Galactic Gear of Anakin Skywalker. It's a cool card. Nice insert. And the last card of the pack, a Django Fett Refractor. Pack number six. Boba Fett's Rancor, Bail Organa, Padme Amidala, Ezra Bridger, and a Finn Refractor. Pack number seven. Saw Guerrera base card, Mace Windu, Qui-Gon Jinn, another Galactic Gear of Darth Vader. Pretty good pulls on the Galactic Gear inserts. And the last card, a Lola Refractor. Pack number eight. Toro Calican base card, Rancor Keeper base card, Dio, Supreme Leader Snoke base card, and an Eris insert. Pack number nine. Taladurith base card, the Grand Inquisitor, Lando Calrissian, General Grievous, I like that card quite a bit, and a Pit Droid Refractor. All right, last pack out of the box, pack 10 of these regular packs. Grogu base card, Syntakaz, Kanan Jarrus, C3PO, and then a Reva Refractor. All right, to recap the pulls from this Costco Super Box, got eight regular refractors. Got some pretty good ones. Four inserts, one of the Eris, one of the Galactic Civil War, and then two Galactic Gear of Darth Vader and Anakin. Got pretty good ones on those. And for the Costco exclusive silver packs, we did get two refractors, one of Grand Admiral Thrawn and one of Saw Gerrera. And I just noticed something very interesting about this Grand Admiral Thrawn card. There is a difference. You guys are probably screaming at me watching this video down in the comments already. This Costco version does get the debut medallion. The regular one does not have it. So here on the right is the normal Grand Admiral Thrawn refractor, no debut medallion. Here on the left is Grand Admiral Thrawn with the debut medallion. That's pretty cool. I wonder if there are other characters that did get the debut medallion for the Costco cards. Let me know down in the comments if you've picked up any of these Costco boxes and what your pulls were and if you've seen them on shelves or not. If you've enjoyed this video and would like to see more collectible related content, I encourage you to consider liking and subscribing. That would help out my channel. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day.